Okay, is everybody there? So we've got a good one today. Today should be an easy day. Again, number one goal today is to get out when we're up. Um, I'm saying this and of course today probably everything will <laughs> go to the dream target because if the market does indeed continue lower here today, <laughs> this will definitely go, but um, I think the best thing to do is to get out fast. So maybe we'll, maybe we'll do two things today. So let's do low, let's do it, get out, and then I'll look around, see what else there is to do. <laughs> Remember, Netflix has been on our radar. And uh, we're watching it, watching it. And then we have, again, the claims, unemployment claims out tomorrow. So we'll see what happens with that. Um, I'll look at that one yeah later, later, Jackie. I'm thrilled we have this. It's really good. In fact, the option I called in it, you know, you can do that strike, you could do a different strike, it's up to you. Um, I'm talking. Can everybody hear me? If you can't hear me, you gotta sign out and sign back in. Bullseye says he can't hear me, but I'm talking. So this does have a spread. We will account for that. Enough. I hope it's not a dollar. Jeez. And let's also make sure that this is open. Wow, it is spready. Look at that. Definitely spready. What is going on with this? One fifty two. It's definitely open. Wow, I'd be I'm just I'm just gonna be so excited if today's the day the market does what I thought, but I almost I almost don't even want to talk about it. <laughs> just let it do it. Here, target's gonna fall. Interesting. Um, and Walmart's definitely lower. All right, let's go back to low. One fifty-three, sixty, and I don't have the entry yet. I'm just kind of just giving you some kind of an idea here where I think we're gonna put the stop. Actually, that's going to change, so just wait. Just wait. I have no entry here yet. I have, I have no stop yet. Just wait. We're just going to sit, and we're going to wait for the perfect setup. Netflix. Oh, doesn't this look good, though, today? Should we do Netflix? We could do Netflix and Lowe's. 482.75. Gosh, it's going to be four and a half bucks. Let's wait and see if we get a better entry in Netflix. We could do Netflix today and Lowe's. All right, back to the Lowe's. Back to the Lowe's. 154. It's just so big. I'd say, I think, I think I'd put it over 154.80. 154.80, and I don't have the entry yet. This is not going to be a small stop either, unfortunately. I think we got to do 151 by 154.80, and it is big. Sorry, people. 151, 154.80. Nothing I can do about it, and I'll go back over to the Netflix. Okay, let's do 50, 50 by 80. 151, 50 we can do now. There, do it, get in it, and put this stop. 154, 80, it's not, it's, just, it's a big stop. That's what it has to be. 
But this is it. Here we go. We'll talk about targets in a minute. Just want to double check we've given that enough room. Let's give it 85. 154.85 is the stop on lows. And I will go back and look at the Netflix. This is going to go today. Yay. Who's in the options? I called in this. Some people got out. I, I don't know. Maybe we should have just done it there at four and a half bucks, but it's it's going to go. This is a day for Netflix. Gosh darn it. Maybe we should have just done it, but I really thought we could get a better entry. This is it. This is it. This is lows. Lows, lows, lows. Let's pay attention here. Make sure we don't miss our exit. Maybe I can find a good entry in Netflix, but it, it, that might have been it. I mean, it is almost $500. So, you know, when you figure... Maybe that's just what it's going to be now from now on to do these. We had, we had a good entry, though, the other day. Here goes the cues. I'll keep looking at that. All right, we're in the lows. We got one thing here. Maybe we'll do something else today. For now, at least we got one. All right, let's talk about targets. Somebody, anybody, tell me what do you think the targets are in low? In fact, maybe we can add. Here, new plan of action. Let's add in the low, double up on it, and I'll tell you where. One fifty thirty. One fifty thirty. You can take more low. The stop is the same. That is not there yet, but this is another idea here. 145, Jackie's saying. 140 is the dream target. I think 146, 147 is a normal target. Low today was 149.26. So, so those are normal targets. 140 would be a dream target. Yeah, 146, 147 I think is normal. 140 is a dream, not 145. Let's just see if it's going to hold. And make sure you have the stop in. I do think this does hold. We have to be a little patient. So if everything falls, though, today, this is going to fall, too. We'll have to wait and see. Because we are waiting. Netflix. Really wondering what's going to happen with the momentum in that. When is that momentum going to come in? It's going to be soon. If you did not do this, you could do this at the 150, 160, 150, 150. If you didn't do it, you could do it when that hits again, stops the same place. And then again, you can add at 150, 30. Actually, I did call a good strike in this, so, for the put, so. <coughs> I don't know why this is so spready. Time of the dice, 9.37. And I don't think we have any significant data out today. I think all of the data is mostly tomorrow. But I'll, I'll quick check here one second. Today is Wednesday. Tomorrow is Thursday. is the 18th. Okay, Wednesday. We have one thing out of 1030. That's it. So you can have it at 154.85. 154.80, I don't think that makes much of a big deal. I don't think this needs 155. It shouldn't continue any higher after that initial 
jerky reaction and now the pushback we're getting here if you did not do this you could do it even under 152 if you want I mean, the market's definitely really tricky lately. And, I, and, and again, and this is selling off. This is tricky too. I think we're gonna get this today. Oh, we, we, we got the one yesterday, I just didn't get out, right? Let's go look at Netflix. Do we do Netflix or not? No, let's just, let's add in the lows if it gives an ad and we'll leave Netflix be. Oh, the banks. That was the other thing I wanted to look at. See where they are in relationship to the spy. That came out, I think I saw news yesterday, Goldman's laying off another swarm of people. I wonder how many of these companies have uh, Stopped renting out office space. Like, I wonder how many people are permanently going to be working from home for these companies. Actually, we might get an ad above our price now. Let's see. So originally I said 150.30. If this ends up holding here, we may get an ad pulling our price up. Let's just see how this goes. At least the spread's tightening up a little bit here. Nine forty. So when we're done here, we'll go over the market. I don't want to get off this, so I don't miss my exit on this. Uh, but when we're done, we will go over the market. I just want to make sure we have a good exit on this yesterday. I've had my caffeine. A lot of you did a lot better than me yesterday because you got out of that, that Walmart so quick. Looking back and thinking about that and analyzing what I did with it yesterday, the fact that I didn't call an option in that Walmart, I said to myself, why was I looking for a big number? Because usually when I call a day trade and an option in the same thing, I'm really in love with it. And because I didn't call the option in it, I thought back, I should have just got out of it like a, like a trade because I wasn't that in love with it or I would have called an option in it. And I was like, I realized that then after the fact, like when I was thinking about it, because I wasn't that in love with it, or I would have called an option, and the fact that I didn't do an option in it, I wasn't that in love with it, so I shouldn't have been looking for a big number. Do you know what I'm saying? Right, like today. I am in love with this, but it is taking its good all time. There's a reason for that. Target was up, that's number one. Two, it also was down a lot this morning. Big sell-off bar that happened a couple uh, days ago, whenever that was, a week ago week and a half so this has to get this has to situate itself out this has to this just needs to situate itself this isn't going to have to take all day though but it's it's just working itself out so in the end I did call the grid strike on this because if I called anything lower it wouldn't have gone the same any questions while we're waiting for low? Anything else anyone else was looking at? Gyro, you didn't put any ideas in the room. Was there something that you liked? I know you do look at longs. Amazon looks amazing. Who did I say this is probably going to gap down today? Elaine, I think I said. Amazon, 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 Amazon. And that's the one to watch again today for the market direction. 
because there's no way that Amazon is going to sell off like hotcakes and then have the market at new highs. That is impossible. It will never, ever, 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 ever happen. And so watch Amazon. I said that on all the ones yesterday. And here we go. Let's pay attention. Why don't we do this, people? Let's add on this under the break of 152. Not that far off where we were at, but a little bit above where we took it. If you want to wait till 150, 130, which is a dollar away, that's fine too. Here, take more of it if you want it right in here and put the stop at the same place. 154.85. This is going to be a good trade. And we are not going to miss our exit today. All right, here we go. All we need is a break through the low. Boom. Drop out. Doom. Here we go. We're back around. Here it goes. Um, CN? Oh, I didn't look at that. Here, I'll look at NVIDIA as well. I really think NVIDIA has a huge potential. What was this for? This is a sector gap. This was an earnings. I'm guessing here, Gyro, or what was the story with CN? Oh, you could have had a nice little trade in this. You could have had a wonderful little trade in this. Yeah, you should have told me about that earlier. Maybe we could have done that little guy too. I really do like the lows the best, but maybe we could have done that little one too. NVIDIA, NVIDIA moves so fast. It's it's sort of like Tesla almost. I don't know. It's hard to believe that anything's like Tesla, but it's kind of like Tesla. Like, like you could walk away and make yourself a sandwich and come back and this could be down $30. Like literally, that's what this is like. And I think we need to start playing this more. I quite frankly, here we go. Low. If you did not do this, you could do this here. If you did not add, you could add here. It broke through every number I've given and we're in it. And this is a nice call. And we're gonna make money on this come hell or high water. And if we want to be really super duper conservative, which I tend not to do, but if you want to, you could almost, if you did the ad, take half out, book money on the half, let the rest ride to a big piggy target. There's another idea. I could have done that yesterday too. I tend not to trade like that, but but you could do that. You could do that very well here. Sector, yeah. Here it goes, here it goes, low, low, goodbye low. You know what, low is a good place in my hometown to go and get shrubberies, plants and things, mums and shrubberies and stuff like that. They have better plants and things than like Home Depot, I think. Here it goes. That was a nice call. All right, hope everyone's in this. And then let's take a look over here. Yep. So again, we're definitely gonna talk about the market today when we get out of the lows, but let's wait. Here we go. Let it drop, drop, drop. Let it turn into a rubber band. But if you're worrying, if you're super duper worrying, because the way Walmart reversed yesterday, and, and again, almost all of you got out except for like three people that were in that with me and didn't get out. You know, if you're super duper worrying, get out of half of this, get out of some of this now, and then wait and see what occurs through the rest of it. It does have a big target if it continues. I do not think that I'm being a pig about this today, even still with yesterday. I really think this is a good gap. I truly believe this is lower. The market is not against this. Let's see. But to think that something goes down, you know, for 30 minutes every one minute straight, that isn't reality. And we know that's not reality. Now let me go over here and look at what see what's out for tonight. Jack is tonight, LB is tonight. Nvidia's tonight. Oh crap. Nvidia's tonight. I didn't know that. Ah, shoot. Oh, I'm going to have to make a decision on that today. But I, I better send an email out to people. Nuan is tonight. BJ's is tomorrow morning. Macy's is tomorrow morning. That stock is very sad anymore. 
Shine is tomorrow morning. Campbell Soup is tomorrow morning. We have a lot of good things tomorrow morning. Let me get an email out about NVIDIA to tell people. I don't know. that Now that I know that the earnings are t tomorrow night or tonight, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm not sure if that's going to move what I thought today. Why did I think that I already had the earnings? Because I seriously thought that I already had earnings. Gosh, that's late. <sighs> okay, did anyone get out of Lowe's? Because I did not, but I told you you could have. Very similar to what I said yesterday when I said you could get out of the Walmart. I should have listened to myself. I'm going to get 100 emails here about what I think of these NVIDIA earnings as soon as I send this email. You know that's what's going to happen here. <laughs> but I'm going to send it anyways. All right, let's talk about the market because I'm going to wait this through. Okay, let's talk about the market. 